This is Ben from MoodleUserGuides.org. This is a quick video on using folders to tidy up your Moodle course. So you can see I have a week here and I want to add some readings to the week. I'm going to make sure I turn editing on so I can edit my course. And now I can add files by dragging and dropping them in. So I have over here a folder, I'm going to open that up. And I can even just grab all of these files and put them in the course right here. You can see they're uploading. Well, now what I have to do is I have to move them one by one, maybe by dragging them to where they need to go. And if I want to indent them, like I have the other items indented under their headings, I need to do that one by one as well. So let's try a better way. This time I'm going to click add an activity or resource and I'm going to scroll down to resources and choose folder. I will title this week two reading. And now I have a Dropbox, I can actually add my files right there and they'll all go onto the same place. I can choose whether or not I want to show them uh, in the course, on the main course page itself or kept nice and tidy within that folder and whether I want to allow students to download. So I'm going to do a save and display. I now have this folder that contains all of my files. I do want to show one more thing quickly, just a shortcut or a bit of a time saver. If I make a zip file from my folder that contains my files that I want to upload, I can actually even save a step of making the folder in Moodle. So I'm on a Mac, I'm going to right click on my folder and choose compress. That is going to then create a zip folder copy of that file. If you're on Windows, the process is really similar. You right click on the folder and choose send to and then compress and that's gonna create a zip folder on Windows. Now what I can actually do is just drag and drop my zip file directly into Moodle. That's actually going to recognize that the zip file contains multiple files inside of it and offer to make me a folder automatically. That is a great time saver. Hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you next time.